Telling jokes and having smokes Riding bikes all through the night It's a wild ride When you're being in Coffee ice no matter what Now you know he likes it in the butt It's a wild ride When you're being in Being in And life is shit but you're positive Let's find out what it's like to live a life Being Ian, being Ian With Jordan <laughs> Guys, is, that, o- it, is that Obama? Is that real? He's on a $9 bill? Yeah That's real? I bought it in Philly <laughs> That's exactly The Obama dollar Yeah, Obama's over there Yeah, put him on a fucking nine Yeah Nine dollar bill Are we selling this to support him or mock him? I don't know Both <laughs> Both, a little bit both. of both I have so many pictures in my phone of after Obama won Obama license plates when from he Delaware. Win? He won, oh. Nobel Prize. He did. When he stole the election. <laughs> yes. He's, he's still running the country. A video came out of him in 2008 being like, uh, <laughs> Was he yeah. showing his Hawaii passport? Yeah, and he was putting on huh? a green bandana pledging allegiance to Hamas. Uh, uh, no, he was like, they were like, how do you ensure that the Republicans won't steal elections? He goes, well, let's be honest. Republicans rig elections. We all know Democrats rig elections. So now this is like going around like, see? Trump did win in 2020. Did you did you see a Biden clip where he's like with Elton John? He's like, just so you know, this guy is the reason he's it's his it's all his fault that we spent nine billion dollars on taxpayers' money for AIDS to 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 no. get it. Yeah, you've no. never seen this clip? No. Oh, it's Who is so saying? good. Oh, that's the best. Biden. Biden's with Elton John. He's trying to say it's because of this man that we are yes. we are fighting AIDS. Oh, you were so important. But what to he's the saying movement. is this he goes, is the guy it's who all this man's fault. <laughs> This that, man that. fucked a monkey one day singing his song <laughs> on the keyboard. He goes, it's his fault. It's this guy. It's this guy's fault. We spent $9 billion to tax payers' money on AIDS. On AIDS. You know, Danny, so, your song was about uh, gay sex. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, this guy helped me. Hunter, Hunter's got an AIDS. He's yeah, helping yeah, me yeah. get rid of him. <laughs> Dude, it's, it's it, like, you know what someone told me? My friend, I can't say who, because he's connected to the government. But he said... This is a great weird trick. You can't run constitutionally for three. You can't serve three terms. But Obama could run again as a vice president under Biden. And if Biden died while in office, then he could slide in as president. Wouldn't that wow. be a whoopsie doozy? And legally, that could that could it be fine. He could serve a third term because he's not voted in as president. He could be vice president. Isn't that wild? And I go. Are the Dems on to this? <laughs> Do they know about this? Because that's honestly a great card trick. That's a good. They would never. I mean, they would never. Obama would never go back. He wouldn't. He went no so fucking gray. way. He He'll so never go wife. back. Yeah, he's so happy now. Netflix gave him like a hundred million dollars. Yeah. Oh yeah, be a consultant on our film. Yeah. 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 You lose. He. He. It would be way worse if he. If he did. Uh, I see this picture of Carlin up there. Least favorite comic ever. Really? No, but wouldn't that be if I took that stance? Hilarious. Wouldn't that be great? I almost spit out my drink. I, was <laughs> I know. Like, wow, that wouldn't would that be, be great? great. That would be awesome. Well, okay, who is it? No, obviously not. That's unfortunate. Uh, who do you hate? Who's overrated? who's so fucking huge? Mitch that- Hedberg to me. Oh, <gasps> wait, you don't like him? <gasps> He's fine. He's just wow, fine. this is wild. Wow. This one's tough for me to Chappelle hear. Chappelle for me. David? <laughs> <laughs> Imagine. I love Mitch Hedberg. I just think that the way people are, he reminds me of, of Union Hall, Brooklyn. Okay, how about, I'll do, I'll do mine since we all are shooting. Let's go. Uh, Bill Hicks to me is like, who cares? Wow. I just yeah. don't care. I'm sorry. Louis I, Black or Bill Hicks? Which one? Which Cheers. one's better? Yeah. Louis Black. Louis Black all day, Louis Black. Louis Black, wow. Louis Black. I agree it's with you. It's not a competition. I'm just saying, I like Bill Hicks, but they treat him like, like he was a god amongst men. He was f- good. Mm-hmm. Yeah. He was good. Low key, one of top. I know this is for everybody, but it's not a comics opinion. Is yeah. Regan? Been listening to Regan. Dude is good. Yeah, Regan's so good. But he's yeah. he's so. Good. I was listening to it the other day, and I was like, cry- like I haven't no, laughed like he's that a to comedy. One of my best memories with Kenny. Was you have to speak into the microphone if we're going to. Oh, we're not stuff even up. recording. Yeah. Oh, oh, we are. What do oh, you let's start. Fucking let's think start. we're doing. I have. It's fine. Let's I, start. Ethan, a fan gave me these two little microphones that I meant to bring you that you put like into a table. Could we use those? Okay, great. Then I'm Here. going to. <laughs> Ready? 
All right, let's start. This is going to be a really good episode. Welcome, Welcome to be and Ian with, with your... Jordan. Patreon.com slash Ian Pod. I haven't watched that much Mitch Hedberg. But what I've seen, I think it's funny, Reese's, Reese's Peanut Butter Cup. Yeah, I think it's good. It's just a little, I want somebody who's like human, moving around, I know, but he was so, but he was extremely unique. At least give him that. Unique. Yes. Yes. Yeah. Masterfully not, brilliant. He's not, now, people he was... think he's Kurt Cobain of comedy. He ain't. What? They both did shoot themselves mm. in the head. No, yeah. their wives did. Let's get that's that what straight. I, that's what I was saying. Mm-hmm. <laughs> you think it's strange that we're in a basement and we're right next to the tunnels? Can you hear them ever digging down here? We do. You hear them digging? We do. Yes. Yes, we hear no, different it's, it's bagel No, it's jangling orders. coins is what really what you hear while they're digging. Ding, 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 ding. I wish they just, like, why can't they just have a spokesperson that's like, we did it during COVID so we could kick it with our friends. Yeah. Just, why well, do we have to like inflate this to some well, weird also, conspiracy theory? did you see theory? the video They of just the wanted police, to hang out with their boys. The police catching them and they all run away like this. <laughs> it didn't help their case. No, it doesn't help the case. It's it, was, it was so fun. But you know who else has tunnels under major cities? The Turtles. The fuck, yes. Ninja. The French. The French. The yeah. French. That's yeah. what they've been doing. So this is just a cultural appropriation again. Mm-hmm. It's interesting that Palestine also does it. Do they? Yeah. And what's going on down there? <laughs> <laughs> it's funny that the Jordan, Jew, the, let's Jew, hear. the Jews took a chapter out of the Palestinian mm. dig book. I've been going to NYU uh, with uh, pro-Israel signs <laughs> just to piss off some of the kids. That's great. Oh, yeah. Just because, just to stir it up. Mm-hmm. I stand mm-hmm. outside of the dorms, mm-hmm. pro-Israel. Um, they they don't like it. <laughs> they don't, <laughs> they don't like it. Wait, dude. no, no, no. But have we figured out why they dig the tunnels? We're talking about Hasidic Jews, for those who don't know. Hasidic we Jews were Hasidic. digging the tunnels to get from synagogue. To, uh, genuinely, during COVID is what yeah, the speculation is. Because they weren't Somebody allowed. Somebody told me there's they weren't like allowed a tier. Congregate. There's like, there's like buildings where there's tiers of Hasidics and they all have like a different ideology. So the ones that were on the bottom floor were one ideology and they didn't want to fraternize with the upper tiers. No, so that's they... the caste system in India. No, no, no. <laughs> there's something about this. Ethan, can we... I, uh, can I just say, when we talk about the Jewish, Jewish tunnels, anytime you go, any of us go, yeah, well, I heard, it's probably a lie. Yeah, that's yeah. a lie. And it's probably it's some fun. inflammatory thing about Jewish people. Yeah. It's like, always. you know what I heard? I'll tell you what, there was a mattress yeah, down yeah. there. Yeah. <laughs> no, you know who did it also? If go to go to Chicago. That's where Prohibition, they were building tunnels for booze to get from place to place. Also, it's there's smart. Tu- there's so many tunnels in New York that have been dug for a hundred years. But I think about- they weren't worried at all about structural soundness, so they were just digging it right below the surface where it could yeah. collapse at any hey. time. Yeah. Hey, <laughs> just a bunch of Andy Dufresne's walking around like, yeah. oh, geez, <laughs> dumping out, dirt of out, of out of their pits. pocket. Do you know about the Whispering Tunnel? Speaking of tunnels. Your butthole? Yes. It's so got a good. lot of secrets. Thank you so that much. That is a little whisper tunnel. Do you know the Whispering Except Tunnel? Except somebody will, will answer in there. Well, Help! it's pretty loose. It's, <laughs> it's pretty loose. Many it's, voices. It's the Echo Tunnel now. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> What not is true. it? What's the what's the what's the not tunnel? true? <laughs> it's okay. You don't have to validate. My we ass know. doesn't echo. That's not the case. What I said before. The whispering tunnel is my favorite thing in Grand Central Station. There is a uh, tunnel where, if you go in the corner and I go in the corner at a certain angle, when you speak, your your words go through the tunnel, and you can hear on the other side. You can communicate with each other at Grand Central. It takes yeah. you such a is long time cool? to say sentences. Yeah. I had a speech impediment when I was younger, I know, and it took me I a while know. to talk. You and it only into a comes hole out and somebody else can hear you. it somewhere else. That's the because way, I'm uh, like this. Uh, Excitable Boy, one of the best albums of all time. Incredible. Rolling the topless, the headless gunner. Yeah. Yes. But, but, but amazing. But I really like. Um, uh, uh, Desperados Under the Eaves. What's I'll Excitable Boy? Uh, um, Warren Zevon. Oh, um. Uh, I was in the house in the house. Yeah, that, no, but that's not the one I'm thinking of. Keep uh, going. Uh, lawyers, guns, and money. No, nah, but that's okay. I like it. Uh, Who are, uh, what band? Carmelita. Name? Warren Zevon. No. Who's Warren Zevon? That guy. Warren Zevon's one of the greatest artists of, of all, all time. time. An amazing book. If you ever want to read it, it says uh, it on your website. I'm an excitable boy. Yeah, it's from his song. So, well, yeah. he went down to dinner in his Sunday best. Excitable boy, they all said. Nah, 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 nah. He he he, and he, he died tragically of cancer all over his chest. And he was like really rad, and like he knew he was dying, which was even more tragic. And Norman, then he talked about I mean, it. Norm McDonald. Mark Norman. Hey, Norm I'm dying soon. Hey, <laughs> hey, I gotta get Comedy, out of here. Comedy, more like tragedy. Wow. Turns out I'm actually gay. Holy <laughs> shit! 
hey, after all these years. Whoa, yeah. It's like you're throwing your voice. Wait, that's crazy. Let me close my eyes. Do it again. Hey, hold on, hold on. Jordan, Ian, couple of Jews. Only one of them is. You'll Whoa. figure it out. Whoa. Wow. It's pretty good. Wow. Really now, good. dude, Mark Norman is Bernie Mac. Uh, <laughs> <laughs> so I ain't good. scared of you, motherfuckers. Yeah. No, I, I ain't scared of you, motherfuckers. <laughs> <laughs> I'm big bone. <laughs> Does he have his, like, fused back? I'm not fat, I'm big bone. <laughs> yeah, get out of here. Ah, yes! Is that good? Uh, that's, that's so good. good. That as was soon as great. I heard, there's certain people's voices I hear, and immediately I go, I can do that. Who? It's just I lock into there's p I don't know no it's not it's not who it's more like when I hear it my my brain goes like a tone it's something about it pitch. my brain goes I can do that mm -hmm. like I tell I actually hear I can it tells myself like oh you know how to sound like that it's you, very strange you want to know something weird about your acting mm -hmm. I rewatched Curb All did right. not know cut the tape listen to me didn't know you were in it. Well, why would you? I don't. It's not, I don't send out. You flyers. were so good in the funny. toilet one, it and I funny. lost my mind when I saw you. And I was like, "That's my friend." I had honestly. That was like I, I've said this to this day. It's like you you like lose money doing that gig because they don't they don't pay you, and it's it's like you work your whole career to lose money at doing that show, which is worth every dime. And it was the coolest moment, not live, but in the audition when I tested with Larry, making him break. Yay! That was like to me, oh like I could God. die. I actually was like, I, I could die. I could be done with comedy for the rest of my making him break in the room. Like he broke, and then he broke the second time a little bit, and then he goes, "All right, get I get get the fuck out of here." Like okay, he was, that's cool. But think about from my oh position. My God. I saw my awesome. friend. Yeah, your friend on the screen. Friend on the telly. Because the first time I saw it, I was like, "This guy's really good." I wonder if he's actually a plumber or, yeah. or a whatever it was, like yeah. a plumber. A plumber. Yeah. And then I saw it again, and I was like, "That I know." It's really. It was. Fu it was super fun. That was my uh, original pitch. I will give myself a little credit. I had. They had. They had said they wanted me to come in and pitch Larry a toilet. You know, they just give you an outline, and they said pitch him a toilet. I was actually supposed to be. I originally read for the guy whose dog was named Adolf. Did you see? The, you know. Mm -hmm. Do you know that guy? Mm -hmm. And Larry was like, "You don't. You don't. You don't look Aryan at all. I mean, mm -hmm. you don't. You're yeah. not the guy. Sorry, man. Yeah. And I was like, "Fuck." And he was like, "No, no, no. It's fine. We'll we'll figure you another read." And you were so like, he gave "Toilet me a man." Shot. But he did. He goes, uh, he he blue collar, right? I said, yeah. And he goes, good, go outside. And and casting director Allison Jones was like, go outside and come back when you have when you're ready. Like, go outside, just take a half hour, get a coffee. And it took me like five minutes because I already knew I knew when I read it, I knew exactly what I wanted to do. And so what did the outline say? Uh, plumber like comes in and pitches uh, at Latte Larry's was the coffee shop. Pitches Latte Larry on a new technology to not get urine on your shoes. I think that's what it, I think that was the original bit. Yeah. And then I made up in the room when I had said that, uh, it, we should have it. We should have the toilet move to the size height of your dick. That's the problem. I was pitching. Like the problem is if you're tall and your dicks, you know, uh, up high, it's going to spray more. If it's down low, it's going to move. And then, so I said, there should be a door. It measures your cock when you walk up and it goes doot, 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 penis detected <laughs> and slides up and then it'll move to the height of your cock. And Larry was like, ah, 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 in the middle of it. And I was like, at first I thought he was fucking with me, but then I realized he was actually laughing. Oh my God. And that's just the sound he makes. He does, his, have you seen his real laugh? His laugh is like, ah, ah, ah. It's so weird. <laughs> oh, it's that's rad. so cool. It's fucking that rad. Cool. Oh my God. That was like my comedy come moment. That and making Julio Dreyfus break. That was like another. Oh my God. Veep like a thousand times. They tried to get me on that show so many times. And yeah. that, that guy that ran that show, he just like, he's like, it's, uh, it's not the look. And I was like, but it's like the, do you like the character? He's like, yeah, yeah. Do you but, like me? Well, he was always like, no, good, very funny, but not look, no. He just didn't like the way, he's like, I didn't look like what he wanted for. Yeah. That's gingerist. I know, dude. It really was true. It, I genuinely know that's, you know how many times I've been told and they're like, we think we might have to color your hair. Wow. Do they go like. Because uh, they're like, you camera test, it's really bright. When they go on, on auditions, they go, are you willing to shave? You can go yes or no. They go, are you willing to. Dye your hair not what you are. They said no. I've, they've they've asked multiple times. Will really? you dye your hair? Yeah, I always say no. Fuck no. Really? Yeah. Why? What the fuck? What? You either want me this way or you don't. Unless I'm doing. Unless Scorsese is like, I I want you to I'm, whatever you want. Yeah. But if I'm doing just like a role on a TV show, it's like get fucked. You can't just. I'm a real guy that exists. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. yeah, yeah. Like, you can't funny. erase me. What are we talking about? <laughs> it's fucking. It's a weird. It's a weird thing, but. But anyway, yeah, I'm happy. the The curb thing was crazy that I didn't know that was you. That I was mean, like I saw it so highlight. long ago. That's yeah. so cool. It's really of all cool. the bullshit we do. Those are, there's a, those things I, I'll hold forever till I'm dead. I don't give a fuck about 
most things I do in terms of pride wise, but that one, I really wanted to be funny. That was like, so that's like so much pressure. There's no yeah. pressure in most of the stuff I've ever done. That one really, I was so fucking nervous because all day. Because it's like action. It's just with Larry. Yeah. It's just with him. That's all it was. If I, I like, are you are you listening to his beats to respond, or are you already in your head when he says? No, 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 no. You're. It's. I mean, you have to be listening because he, yeah. he goes on a million different directions, and he doesn't like um, too much improv. Turns him off big time. Mm. You can feel really? when, when people are doing too much. You know when you get away from the story in an improv scene, and some people like go so far from it that you're like, how are let's we gonna- try. Ethan, go. give us a suggestion. There you go. Good improv, Ethan. <laughs> I'm not good at improv. I don't know. I uh, did. I helped John Radinsky with his self tape yesterday, and it made me want to act so bad because he I was like, "Just riff back." Wait, I've it never so done fun? it. It's I've fun. always wanted to do it. Oh, it's we did fun. it the other day. Yeah, it's child's play. You're yeah. dre- you're playing dress up. I want to yeah. play dress up. You should. We okay. did. We had to play mental patients. In but when our I went into an acting to person, they're like, "You could be somebody's patients? mom." Yeah, and I hurt my feelings. Really? Wait, wait, they say you could be someone's mom. You could be like a ceramic grandma teacher mom. Yeah, but you. What do you mean? How old are you? 32. You could be a mom. Yeah. yeah you, you take totally that like could. that's a negative thing. Well, you're not, you're not to be 20 like cool, anymore. You just wanted to be like a cool. Yeah, you but, could be a 20 year old slut. <laughs> yeah. You could be a <laughs> whore. Oh, yeah. 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 <laughs> yeah. Why don't you just be a whore? Yeah. Mm, a you godless be, whore. You'd be a twerking cum guzzler. I want to play that 21 role. 21 years old. And you're like, <laughs> oh, yeah. yeah. I yeah. want to play that role in Louis' show with, with the with the older woman who he has to eat her pussy. That would oh, be that ideal. That was so funny. That was great. So funny, she man. That show rules. was so good. That's so mm. good. I rewatched the fuck out of that show. The end, the N word button in the art gallery is by far the funniest. You know what I'm talking about. Mm-hmm. Yeah. When it's she one of the greatest that, shows of all time. That makes me laugh so hard every time. And I know it's coming. Yeah. But it's the way he it's says his, it. And it's his eyes. It's the way he's always like. Well, and Pam Adeline, if you watch it, I'm, this is me nerding out, but she breaks, and you actually, they leave it in. I love breaker. that. But you can see that she breaks, because she when she turns, she goes, oh, no. Like, you watch her turn away and laugh, and the audio still had it in there. I know they tried to clean it up, you can tell, but I've rewatched that scene so much that I, I was love like, she broke. seeing people break. Oh, I watch Jimmy favorite. Fallon on SNL break all the time. Liar, liar. <laughs> Everybody breaks at every, every moment. Oh, yeah. <laughs> You Always pulled a liar, me. liar. You called me an overactor on set. Wait. <laughs> yeah, you knew that reference? You knew that reference? Yes, of course. Oh, I love liar, liar. I showed you that. I found I'm a so ticket stub from 1997. Dude, we have to says. frame those two. He found a Misfits ticket stub and a liar, liar movie ticket stub. Where would stub. you keep this? In a shoebox in your mom's house? Yes. Yeah. Did you bring it? No, it's still in my mom's we house. We got to bring it and frame it. I'll buy a frame. And I Okay. Yeah. And I found my grandfather's wallet and he had like a joke business card that was like Peter L. Longcock <laughs> specializing in <laughs> widows <laughs> maidens your dad <laughs> no my dad's dad and behind it I found a punch card for a clinic in Wilmington so really I think he had some is it still there no, this is like 82 everyone at SCD is in 82 my oh, guy yeah that was like the time to get it. Mm-hmm. On the way to AC, there was billboards um, every like 20 feet. I'm not kidding. Where syphilis is real and it's back. They were all over. The- I swear to God. Oh, wow. my God. And it was like syphilis. It's like a pregnant woman in a shadow. And it's like a syphilis will hurt your baby. Wow. Meaning people are getting syphilis and they're just like, fuck it. Fuck it. They're treating it like it'll just go away. Well, remember monkeypox? No. In the gay community? I don't remember monkeypox. What? You don't remember it? You I don't, hear, you don't I heard about it. Happened? I heard about it, but I do think. And all the testing clinics and the lines look like the hottest nightclub in town. My <laughs> friend got short, it. Short, short guys. Like, yeah. How many times did you get it? Tested? A lot. You got Andrew. a lot. Andrew. No. Sorry. I didn't get it. But I, you were worried about it. I No, because I abstained. He abstained, yeah. I my friend, my gay friend, got it. From Beautiful man. Salacious deliciousness. But wait a minute, monkeypox is easily curable, right? That's not a. That's like a shot, and you go home. It can scar you forever. I think that's the yeah, fear. Yeah, some of these well, dudes all were STTs scar you forever, emotionally. Right here. <laughs> wait, it scars your face? Yeah. Oh, oh I yeah. didn't know that. That's where these guys are from. Gnarly. My pimple scars, scars are. My pimple scars are just fucking. Uh, my acne scars are monkeypox. You can laser. <laughs> Maybe those my mom now. lied to me. Did my mom get? I was what born in eighty three. Did she give? Did my mom give me it, monkey monkeypox? Monkeypox was like monkey two pox. years ago. He just no monkeypox. It's been around was for around, a long time. It went away and it came oh, back. Oh, yeah, oh. we like shut it down. Cough. I never got chicken pox. I got the vaccine though. That's, that's bad. actually that's actually really bad. You that's should really, get it. Really I got the vaccine. Bad. I got the vaccine. Yeah, but still, I got the vaccine. Well, yeah, you're in your young thirties, so you probably also got like the um, <gasps> the, what is it, the HPV vaccine? You got that one yeah. too, yeah. dude. That's why you everyone got in our shingles. generation doesn't have it. People that get shingles get shingles because they never got monkeypox. That's true. You got shingles on your back? 
I didn't get shingles. She's fucking Rash McGillicuddy. I'm She's just always Rash getting McGillicuddy. rashes. Old Rashy McGillicuddy. Yeah, yeah, Hello, yeah, Rashy. Glad to meet you. Okay, Rash McGillicuddy is at the bank. She needs money for oh, more medicine for her rashes. Go. <laughs> excuse, excuse me, doctor. You're not a doctor. <laughs> No, no, I'm a doctor. I'm in line at the bank. Oh, good. <laughs> Thank God. I felt it. I felt a peripheral feeling. Well, how can I help you? But there was a doctor. I have, well, when I was a young child, I, I didn't get monkeypox, so they gave me a vaccine. And now I think I have shingles from it, which I thought was like an old person disease, but it turns out it's just like an in- itchy skin thing. A lot of cool people have it. It's not, you know, it's not like a old person thing. I'd like to make a deposit. <laughs> Excuse me, there's a line. That's it. <laughs> That's it. <laughs> That's it. <laughs> Imagine inquiring about your rash to a doctor in a line at a bank and how fun that would be because you're just bugging him. You're like, listen, you're a doctor. You have to look at this. Oh, yeah. We're, we got 10 more minutes before we even get up there. You have to see my rash. I've yeah. never had a rash, but I imagine... You've never had a rash. Never had a rash. Never. I, had, I had to go in for bed bugs and I went to a acidic place on accident and he said, hold on one second. And he parked his <laughs> he parked his little receptionist in the corner. Because it turns out he needed like a witness to watch. Just so he was just watching as I like undressed, and he looked at me. It felt so bad. How for bad him. were the bed bugs? Well, that's the thing. We don't know if it was bed bugs because I got it. My house searched twice. They couldn't find it, but I just had like a. I had really itchy bugs. Which is the shingles. That no, could be shingles. Shingles. That does sound out. like shingles. No, but yes. they're not little. They were big welts. That's huge. Shingles, I think that's shingles. shingles. I think no, bugs. I think, I'm I think, allergic I think bed to bugs mosquitoes. are small. Yeah, they, they were small? not bed bugs. Shingles bug are big. Shingles yes, are pretty big. Dude. Yeah, you had shingles. You have to have chicken pox to be able to have shingles. Like so, it's like uh, ch- you have to have chicken pox as a child. And then well, yeah, like he's right. You only get them when yeah. you got bitch. I thought you get if you hadn't had chicken pox, you're listen, more listen. susceptible. Everybody to shingles. in this room has no idea what they're talking he about. Sir, 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 oh, he sir, myself included. You're a doctor. <laughs> yeah, please. <laughs> Help he, this woman. Ian wanting to be in a movie so Before bad. Before you Rash, make it to Rashi, Rashi McGillicuddy. He did this with Bobby as well. Five foot seven, <laughs> New York City, Ian Fidance, AIG. John Radinsky yesterday I-I-G. was like, I'm against slating. And I was like, I kind of feel you. Slavery? Slating. <laughs> I might agree. Something in me. No, slating. Oh, when you say, hi, I'm this yeah. height, this tall. Because he thinks they're going to judge you? I just think, why are we doing that? It's dehumanizing. I think it's a good opportunity Acting to- is dehumanizing. The business is dehumanizing. So whenever someone's like- uh, it's against my moral code. It's like mm, this is a yeah. this is a business and of I lizard said that, people. That's only because you're five six. I mean, if he that's was true, if he was yeah. full man height, it wouldn't. Yeah, <laughs> yeah. I'm six one. I have no problem saying it into the camera. Six I one think is this, the ideal height. I think it's the, the number one height is a good way to give an entry point to your personality. Like the I way know, you did it. Ian Finance, five foot seven, New York City, or wherever you want me to be. <laughs> How tall are you, Ethan? That's what he does. He does say that. Five no, seven. I don't. He, yeah, you, last time you're like, I'm gonna be back and forth <laughs> between. <laughs> California and New York. You do that whole thing where you're like, I'm bicoastal. I have have places all over. I'm bicoastal, bisexual, and bi-baller. Which one do you got to (laughs) get? We don't know. You get it's like the that's like the perfect triad of like you have to pick two of the three. Uh This week I'm bicoastal and bipolar. Yes. Let me ask you something. Mm. Here we go. I have a show that's a new joke show in L.A. You did it. Yeah, I did it. Did you do it? I did it. Good. Yeah. Thanks. What are you going to ask me about it? I have a San Diego gig. Oh no, no, yeah, no. Okay. Yeah, that's... What does he know? He's just a doctor. Yeah. But is it stupid? I don't perform stand-up comedy. I to perform go- surgery. <laughs> Mark Norman. You crazy bitch. <laughs> hey, I'm just a doctor. What do you want me to do? Oh, my God. You, you foolish whore. Now, let me put this stethoscope hey. to your pussy. <laughs> He's like the Batman scenario where they had the... Where he couldn't turn his head. Bane? Oh. In... in uh, Michael, Michael Keaton. Michael Keaton. Yeah, Michael yes. Keaton. Where yeah. they forgot yeah, to yeah, get yeah. Which is pretty cool in the new Batman that, that he said. He was like, I want to be able to turn my head. That was a good ode to the nerds. Yeah, take your blood, but I'm not a vampire. All right. <laughs> <laughs> it's like we have two guests. I'm going to do that. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Wait, San Diego, go back. The reason I said no immediately to whatever it is, is San Diego from me, from where I live, is me asking you to go to Philly. It's insanely far away. Right. It's the other. It, but pe- it, keeps people are like, my, uh, it keeps me being like, hi, at the store. That's fine, but San Diego, I'm telling you, San Diego's so fucking far away. Yeah. It's, it is it is genuinely crazy. How long does it take to drive to Philly from here? Two hours. No, maybe I'll set up other Okay, things. fuck that. It's further than that. It's, it's going to take you three hours to get to San Diego well, from LA. Well, can I say Four, my I thing, what I am going to do, Could. and I need your opinion on. I mean the baseball umbrella. Oh, it's a baseball cane. It's a bat umbrella. Baseball bat cane. And it says, oh, it motherfucking is. Ian Fidance, Louisville Slugger Museum. You made this at the museum. I've been to this Shout museum, out. but I didn't yep. make it bad. I couldn't afford it. Mm-hmm. Somebody's rich. <laughs> hey, oh. What yes. was your question? Rich. My question is, 
is this insane? Because the people I say it to tell me it is. I'm flying to Seattle, and I have Seattle, Portland, Sacramento, San Francisco, San Diego, L.A. I'm renting a car in Seattle. Mm -hmm. I'm going to drive to Portland, and from Portland, I'm going to go to Sac, drive to Sacramento, drive to San Fran, drive to San Diego, drive to L.A. Is that crazy? I mean, it's bad math because San Diego is below days. Los Angeles. So you're going south to come back north. You're yes. passing LA. So you should, should have scheduled that differently. It should have been Seattle, Portland, San Fran, uh, Sacramento. We're not at LA. the place where we can reschedule. Well, yes, then, you should do then it. You just have to do it. You don't have a cares. choice. What do you even mean? That's not yeah. even. It's not that, even. Is it silly? Yeah, you're going to spend like two full days in a vehicle. Well, it's two thirty-five a week for the rental car, and one flight is like two hundred and eighty dollars oh, from then, one place to another so they it financially it makes like the most sense but people are like it's it's gonna storm in the mountains and you're gonna get stuck and no, you have no, to no, turn no. around None and then that you will have affect to, you at all you, right you, you won't you won't have any of that i'm It'll kind just of be, excited it's just a lot of driving i i've got i think one of them's like an 11 hour drive and i'm gonna get a cheap motel on the road and play turn the page by metallica over and over mm -hmm. oh, no you got to play a lot of bob seger while you're on that drive that's oh. seger that's seger that's seger you know what i used to do i used to play zevon driving through the mountains so good and then mm. what happened nighttime in the switching yard he doesn't know the words mm. i don't know time. this song <laughs> in the switching yard mm. this guy doesn't Why can't sound I think good of the everything fucking... you guys have no no he's really him. you know Send lawyers, guns, and, and money. money you know that song you know werewolves of Dad, london yeah. get me out of this this mess werewolves, werewolves of london ha! Werewolves well, London might be the worst song he has, in my really? opinion. Totally, yes. It just, and, uh, just what's so like interesting it. about him is that he was sober, huge into AA, sobriety. He found out he was dying. Veracruz. Ah. Veracruz was dying. Dude. That's it's such an underrated song. On Porcelain album. monkey. See, he does know. It's funny to not know what you guys. I'm are sorry. About. We'll get it back to something that you know. Sorry um, so much. Oops, I did it again. Who is your favorite artist of all time? <gasps> That's a stupid question. Who do you love? Who's like, man? You know what? Because favorite is insane. It's impossible. Who do I love? Like, who if I met, I would die. Who's who would be on your playlist on your phone where you're like, I don't care what mood I'm in, I can listen to that Misfits. band, The Misfits, and no matter what, no matter what. That's pretty fucking rad. Yeah. Even right if you're there. like in a bad right mood or a always. good mood, always Misfits. There's Does a song for every mood. Yeah. Misfits, uh, I like Beach House for Were we every Rancid mood. fans or no? I like oh, Rancid. yeah. See, I Love like Rancid. Operation Ivy. Rancid. Love Rancid. Operation Ivy was great. But don't put Rancid and Misfits. You got to. I'm not. not I'm, I'm just gauging your levels of like what kind of. But that Billy, was a, that was Billy a good, Holiday, I love. A, a, Frankie a Valley, I can listen yeah. to whenever. Frankie, Frankie Valley. Valley? We yeah. just did this at the cellar the other night. We listed Frankie our top Valley. five Frankie favorite bands. Valley. Marcy Playground. Do we like Ooh. the Four Seasons or not at all? Love the Four Seasons. Okay, okay. My boys. Okay, okay, okay. Love them. You know Warren you know how they met? Don't you know how they met? In Joyce. Because Joe Pesci. Isn't that crazy? They was working Wait, at a bowling what? alley. You don't know this? Now you're doing Tommy Pope perfectly. Yeah. Oh, come on. Fuck you, bitch. <laughs> hey, <laughs> give me a beer. Here's a, here's a video of a dog <laughs> carrying a head. <laughs> Does he send you those? Yeah. Oh, yeah. yeah. He's the one that just sent me that video I showed you guys of water diets. Pope sent me the water uh, diets. Yeah. Offensive. Uh, yeah, no, you know that Pesci introduced them to each other. If, if he Pesci, sang. Pesci was working a bowling alley as a pin setter in Jersey. That makes sense. Pin he monkey. looks like a pin. Pin setter. But they were called pin monkeys. It's racist. I think you're taking it to a direction that we don't need to go today. Well, you should hear what I used to call them. <laughs> go ahead. <laughs> say it, say it, say it, say it, say it. We'll cut it out. Say it, say uh, it, say it. Patreon.com slash being in a bus. Still got. Um, no, but but I feel like the, everybody has an artist. Like yours is Mitzvahs. I feel What's like yours? most of my friends have that I can listen to in any time. Any time? Any time. It's coming on and you're like, fuck. You're yeah. probably going to hate it. It's okay. yeah. You guys are probably going to both be like, shut up. Tyler Childers. I, 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 Sam Cooke. I just, like, I don't... <gasps> Sam oh, Cooke for a... No, the shins are one of my favorites. Sam Cooke? Well, no, the shins are gay. What? Sam Cooke. What's going on? What's going on? These well, things aren't the same. What was that thing? connection? Oh, okay, okay. Yeah. Gay things. Yeah, gay things. Sam yeah. Cooke. Oh. Something about him. I don't know. I just, I just like, I just like... No, what is he saying? You don't know Sam Cooke? Seriously? Let me hear it. I mean, what song would you know the most? Yeah. Probably, like, um... It's a Another beautiful Saturday morning. night and I ain't got nobody. <laughs> I got some money because I just got paid. Wait, no. Now how I wish I had some chick to talk to. I'm in and off. Wait, doesn't he way. do the one? It's Wait, a beautiful morning. No. Sam Cooke. That's not sings Sam Cooke. Wait, Sam Cooke sings that song? The one that I just did. 
Wait, is that I fought the law on the law one? Yeah, it is. It that's, is, that's right? the clash. Yes, that's the clash. Yeah, that's the clash. That's you too. What you just yeah. sang. It's Bono. Yeah. No, another Saturday night is what I sung. Um, Saturday night fever. No. Same. Same melody. Saturday night's the night. I for can't believe you don't know any of these. Like uh, Saturday night by the Bring Misfits. Bring it on home. I was dying <laughs> on a Saturday. He's just night. got su- that's a Misfits. He's got such good you old like soul. Michael Gray's Misfits. I love too. Danzig Misfits and Michael Gray's. I even, like American even. Psycho. Whoa, American Psycho. People Whoa. dog me for liking Graves. People hate when you like Michael I like, Graves. Misfits. I like them both. Love them both. Mm. Both have beautiful voices. You know, my mom met Danzig. I, I met know. Danzig. You've said that so many have times. I told Pretty the much story? every episode. Huh. Yep. Danzig, you met Danzig? Yeah. Mother, tell your children not to walk me. Not to go on the tour bus when I invite you on at a Tower Records at Cherry Hill in 96. Don't go on the tour bus when I invite you on. Oh, yeah. Did he rape somebody? Pull my dick out and then it's on. He invited us on his tour bus. You and your mom? Tickets to the show. Me, my mom, my friend. And uh, Did your mom suck Danzig? She could have, and she should have, and he would have been my dad, but she was like, How no, can you bring your mom around idea. the one person who sings a song? Oh, I raped your mother today, <laughs> and it doesn't matter much to me. Is, that his, is that his song? Last yeah. Caress. Wow. I got something to say. Mm-mm. I killed a baby, baby today, today, and it doesn't yeah, matter much, much to me. He didn't really kill a baby. I think that's hyperbole. No, I think you're right. He's, he's being not, metaphorical. He's not no, no, it's Aussie. drill rock. Oh, drill rock dog? <laughs> drill rock. <laughs> like trap rap? Yeah, yeah, yeah I yeah. get it. Drill rap. I get rock. it. I also like hip hop. I do like rap a yeah, lot. That That's makes sense. Rap a lot. Rap you a lot. Have cursive on your hoodie and your sweatshirt. Well, I just like. I, I, Ooh, I like black people. I, just, <laughs> I have said a lot. I don't like, I don't like any hip hop if it's not black. I don't like white hip hop. You don't like Eminem? I sure. I, yeah, I like him. You don't like that? I like him, but I don't. Mac Miller? Was a wonderful human being. Vanilla Ice. Like I knew him when he was alive. He was a good you did? kid. He was a good kid. I just don't. I just don't love white rap. Snow. Informa. <laughs> Go. You know, it's like what else? Can I want to hear a band? I lick your boom boom down. <laughs> no, I don't like white rap, dude. I just can't get off to white rap. Yeah, my God. Yeah. I didn't know you were saying. Yeah. Yeah. Informa. <laughs> you know, so it's like what else? Can I want to hear a band? I lick your boom boom down. You know who that guy morphed into? No. Modest Yahoo. He's yeah. Like, it's like the same guy. Oh, yeah. It's another. Dude, white... I heard Snow can't read. <laughs> Somebody told me that. <laughs> Snow's illiterate. That's Snow's cool. illiterate. That's fucking rad. Now yeah. I do like him. Yeah. Never mind. I take it yeah, back. Yeah, Snow yeah white rap read. never did it. In fact, I'll say it. I don't care. I don't fucking care. I was fucking whatever with the Beastie Boys. Whatever, same, dude. Same, same. Fucking whatever. Fucking whatever. You One of my first concerts, got a contact high, took my shirt like, off. I don't know. It's like three fucking New York kids that like stealing a black art. They were art, a punk rock band Stealing beforehand. a black art. Stealing I'll a black art. I'll say right art. now, I'm just not a huge fan of rap. I like hip hop so much. But you're just jacking a black art, dude. PC Boys, everyone's like, it's revolutionary. It's like, they're just fucking taking from some black art. Sorry, dude. Like Sorry, Kendrick. dude. That's their thing, dude. I'm... Not offended. You don't have to apologize. No, I don't know. People hate me for it, but I just, I never got behind. Like, I think they made good shit. I think they're dope. You don't but think I was that never they like, opened the door? Is... You don't think that they helped open the door for other things? No. Like what? For what? I was asking because I don't know. No, wow. I don't. I don't. <laughs> you're the doctor. Hip hop was here. Yeah, you're the doctor. Hey, I got to tell you something about rap. <laughs> I love rap. Too bad it's for black people. But I uh... wonder what Norman listens to. Probably just beep 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 boop bop bop beep 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 beep. Computer beep, modem beep, starting beep, up. He just listens. Yeah, he just. Is that you're not gonna believe it? I listen to white noise all day long. Holy shit! At least it's not black noise. We'll be right back. I love him to death. I think he probably hates that I do that because he's heard me do it enough. Really? He yeah, but I feel like a lot of people do. I hear so many people go comedy. I miss that, dude. I don't see those guys. I see nobody anymore. It's so nice to come to New York to see people again. Yeah, but now they're all in I know, and everybody's gone. Yeah, but, no, but dude, it's most. even less so. No one's in Los Angeles because everyone's on the road. Everyone is on the road. Yeah. Everyone, everyone. It's weird. It's like when I go home. The I'll, store? I'll get a text. Yeah, and I'll be like, where are you? And everyone's like, I'm gone. Everyone's on the road, man. Why? Ever since post-COVID, like everyone in LA has just been literally on the road. Mm. If they didn't yeah. move to Nashville or or New York or Austin or wherever, they're all on the road. Even Dude, during the, the week? Yeah, man, people are gone. People well, also cuz I think a lot of people just moved out of the city. Yeah. So they're Covid up in the fucking made people just leave cuz they were like fuck it, I don't want to be here anymore. Dude, I went to It's fucking weird, man. Have you been to Tim Dillon's house? I own Tim Dillon's house. House is up there 
It's nice. No, I've been up to his house. It's very nice. Are yeah. weird though. Well, he it's, it's 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 isolated, but it's beautiful. But I, it's it's exactly where Tim would live. It's you like, can yeah. see he, Sebastian's he palace. How, what does a comic do with that much space? So, was Sebastian? Sebastian has a because you can he see keeps, it. He keeps his he keeps the accent in one of the rooms. Oh, <laughs> <laughs> that makes sense. That makes sense. Can you? <laughs> These people. <laughs> what guys, are you doing? What's this guy doing? With the, 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 <laughs> you no, know what? He, he, but they, those guys, like, uh, they live. Tim lives that life that he, of course, it's beautiful. It's York, exactly what Tim wanted. Yeah. In it's New York, great. that you have like the most a beautiful apartment because it like overlooks the park, but it's still zero square feet. In L- yeah, in LA, you at least get square footage. No, nah, yeah, you can but get nobody, square but you're footage, all comics. but you just gotta nobody pay to... for it out your ass. It's way in more New York. expensive here than it is. Way in more expensive. Yeah. It's just you can get it, but you have to be a fucking, yeah. you have to have hundreds of millions, uh, tens of millions of dollars. Yeah. Here. Yes. Everywhere, yeah. everywhere. Like, I mean, but just here, if you really want like overlooking the park in an apartment, and what are you paying? You're paying like $10 million. Dollars? I could take a hike to the park. I don't need to overlook it. I overlook a park across the street. There's a park right there. Park There's a park right there. And I put my lawn chair outside. Is that and a I scary look park? It. Yeah, it doesn't. Oh, it is. Park. It doesn't look it doesn't scary. Doesn't know anything. It's not scary. scary. Why is it scary? Somebody tried to attack Ethan there. Everybody tries to attack everybody. It's New York. Well, huh? I gotta say this, and take no offense. You do look like you might get attacked. Often. He's a little guy. Yeah, he no, person. it's not that. It's not that. Is that's not a size thing. It's just cute. He's cute. Cute yeah. guys are gonna get attacked. Yeah. yeah. Nobody's attacking me. I kind. I, I look lumberous and uncomfortable and mm-hmm. weird. This guy's six cute. one he, is a fucked up height. It's too big. I'd be a sex one and twelve and a half. And he's see he's and you know what he is. He's cutesy pootsy. When when criminals see him, they go cutesy pootsy coming on the block. They just want to give him a kiss. That's what I do. They grab I him and kiss him. I was over there playing soccer too, so I was asking for it. Oh my god, a cutesy pootsy kicking a ball around. Mm-hmm. I would Man. tear up your butt. Yeah. I'd kiss your neck. <laughs> I'd kiss you on the neck. Yeah, see, that's the problem. If you're cute, you're probably gonna get assaulted in some way or mugged. Yeah, if you're a cute guy, you're fucked. Yeah. Too bad. So sad. Bro, I know I'm so fucked. Nobody. Nobody. What? Nobody. Nobody disagrees nobody. with you. Oh, is what yeah, I'm saying. Yeah, thank you. Nobody yes. would disagree with yes. that. Yes. yes. Agreed. Well, cool. thank you, doctor. Have you been mugged? Uh, I, in a bunch of different ways. What? My ex girlfriend. Well, yeah. emotionally, what are you talking about? No, like, like when I was a kid, I used to tell a joke on stage about it that, like, a guy stole my skateboard like in front of my face. It was like soap. Like when the older guys would like bully you and take. Yeah. Like that, that happened with my guitar, and then my mom married his mom, and they moved in with us. And I was like, "That's the kid who stole my guitar," and they he said to live in my house. Well, you me. got it back at least. Yeah, did you ever think of solving it that way? Yeah, <laughs> just move in with I that bully. Save that for like conflict that. resolution. <laughs> <laughs> oh, I got him back. I that, got my and then I've had, back. No, I've had that One when I was a kid, but never as an back. adult. I've never been like in a stick 'em up. Uh, I've watched people get robbed. That was a joke I really did have on, back in the day. Was I watched a guy get robbed on the subway when I was a kid, and. Uh, he looked at me while the guy was like doing it. I was like nine or ten, or, and I remember being like, <laughs> <laughs> genuinely, I remember being like, no way, I'm not even gonna, I'm not, I'm not supposed to look. Yeah, like my gonna, mom would always be like, look ahead, don't look at people, look ahead. Yeah, she yeah. always said, look forward, don't look at people, because as soon as you make eye contact with someone, they're initiate, you're initiating. My mom would trouble. lie to me and be like, don't, don't make eye contact with people; they can read lips. I'm like, what? what the fuck? <laughs> she would lie to me to keep me in line. Yeah, like, but that's what don't you, crawl on the ground. You'll get AIDS. That doesn't like, even well, that one me. is true. That one's true. Yeah. My mom. Uh, well, is that a bad? My parents lied to me outside of our apartment. Um, we lived way up in this one. I think we were that one. We were on the twenty third floor or something, and we looked down, and I can't remember how old I was seven, and there was uh, blood all over the street. And yeah. the next morning, I asked the door guy what it was. There was cops all night, and my parents had said a paint. A uh, truck that had got into a car accident and spilled paint That's all over the place. That's a good thing yeah. to do. That's a it's good parent. paint. And then yeah. we and the took door your man, dog the door to man, a farm And the doorman literally was like, no, 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 no. That was a hooker. Hooker shot. A hooker shot of John didn't pay her. <laughs> I swear to God in my life. And my parents to this day, they were so fucking mad. They were so fucking mad. Really? Like, Why would you say that to a child? Oh, he was no, like, no, 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 paint truck. That no, was that a lady. He's like, no, no, that was a hooker. I wish it was paint because the things I saw uh, will never <laughs> unsee. But the I, story was great. I guess it was in a, which is why there was so much blood. It was in a, a Jeep Wrangler without the top on. Wow. You know, like a drop top Jeep Wrangler. And he didn't pay, uh, kick this hooker out of his car. And she had a gun and shot him boo, point blank. That's oh. awesome. And then she Sprayed got put in jail. everywhere. So now she's a hooker in jail. No, 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 no. They didn't catch her. Really? They didn't catch this girl. No way. By the way, you're you're you shoot a guy in the head in the middle of the city like that back then, 
There's no like cameras all over the place. Who's catching yeah. you? There's no cell phone camera. You're not like, even getting caught now. Yeah, you definitely are. Now you're definitely getting caught. Now that guy who spidered out of the prison got caught. That was crazy that he got caught. I thought he was. I think if you escape prison, they should let you go. Yeah. If you're incredible. able to break out, they should go. That's great. No. If you squeak up the side like that, like if he did, you get let him out. out and make a certain radius, like like they. If you make past a certain mile marker, they should mm. be like, "All right, okay." This what is if the you real get squid out and games. Then you're allowed to work there. Yeah. That's what this I think. This is squid be good. games. This is you real. Squeak out and you then you get go out. to the front door, and they're like, "We hire you now." And, and you now have you're to be the girl. butler. <laughs> That's good. Uh, yeah, yeah, it's good. That is like ultimate hell, though. They'd probably be like, "I'll yeah. go back in." Fuck that. I don't want to do that. Could you imagine if I'm escaping jail, and I prison. get to a point and I see they're coming? Mm. Prison. Mm-hmm. I'm killing myself. Every time I've been to jail, really, I'm not going back. No, you go back and see if you can do it again. Every time I've been to jail, I do look for a way out. Which Every, is stupid. No, you should look for a way out. That's your your in, your internal instinct yeah. is I'm trapped. I look at the I lock. Get out. I'm like, I can open this. I, I turn my this. shirt into a pillow and just relax. Really? Yeah. Do you ever bite it? Your pillow? <laughs> mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Ian's like, put me in the busy yeah. cell. <laughs> like, oh, I convert to Muslim because I'm going to pray. <laughs> <laughs> How many times do we pray? 40 a day? <laughs> <laughs> Is Mecca a man's ass? <laughs> Have you been to jail? I've been in holding cell. Well, yeah, I've been to jail, uh, but never for anything for real. Never like a DUI. Yeah, yeah. It's always been for like uh, a, street, a street fight. Yeah. You've been Bull- in street fights? College. I went to Arizona State. Yeah. Oh, oh yeah. wow. It's disgusting pig shit. It was disgusting. Yeah. The worst one I ever, I've told the story before, but the worst one, it's not even a good story. The worst fight though was this guy was like almost was yelling at this girl. And then my friend went up to kind of console her. It was outside of a, of a, par- a parking, uh, I mean, a apartment complex. And this guy was like, get the fuck away from my girl. Daughter. He's yelling at her. And my buddy's like, shut the fuck up, dude. You did it over the top. And then all these dudes come out and it's like 10 oh. dudes on, and there's three of us. And I was like, we're going to get the shit beat. I like yeah. literally said, it was like, we're going to get the shit beat out of us. And we did. And we got fucking, we got rocked. Really? One guy got a couple of good shots. And yeah, dude, we got rocked. After I fell to the ground and a guy kicked, I ran as fast as I could. I was like, you're done. You got him. 10 guys, it's over. Yeah. Even yeah. if you get one hit in, they're going to get you. Yeah. Get out of there. So I ran. That was like the worst fight I ever had. That was the worst pain because we were on the ground. We were all getting, getting beat up by multiple people. You were getting goodwill hunting? We were getting hunted. Oh, really? Yeah. Getting beat up by multiple. One on one is fine. I can lose a one on one fight. Oh no! When, when I was young, when it's teaming up body. on you, and you're done, dude. Did they in, kick your face? Yeah, kick me in the head. Kick me in the wow. back of that. Back of the head. I cover. I you. I mean, you know, everybody knows. You go down and cover and cover up as hard as you can. Yeah, I bet you, you do turtle go down. down. <laughs> yeah, I'd go down quick, and I don't come back up <laughs> till I'm done. No, they kick me in the back of that. That that those are the those hurt the worst. Oh. Kicks to the head hurt. Yeah, it's gross. The I sound can, of it, I remember. It like echoes in your head. That can fuck your brain up, right? <laughs> <laughs> yeah dude i went to this is a great this is a weird transition but i'll tell you something strange i went to a uh, my buddy's brother is a ear nose and throat doctor yes ent <laughs> no he's a he's a neuro neuro ne- he's neuro chiropractor so he works with neurology cool. and chiropractic yes because i've had this thing with my back we talked about this yeah. but the one thing he wanted to do is put me in this eye test and they put you in this these goggles and then you look at all these like scanning moving things on the screen and then they zoom into your eyes and then they show you what your eyes look like on a separate camera. And he said, look around your retina. You see all that like jagged growth around your retina. It looks like mountains when they right. zoom in. And I was like, what is that? He's like, it's protein. That's stress. He's like, Whoa. that's either from trauma, stress, or physical damage. Getting kicked in the head. Getting kicked in the head. And it, you know what's so fucking, this really actually, this, you know, something, you, know when you hear something that kind of scares head. you and you're like, what? oh man. He goes, I see similar stuff in soldiers with PTSD. Whoa. Oh. I was like, what happened to me as a kid? He's like, That's oh, scary. pretty good amount of trauma. He's like, he's like, it's not, it's not terrible, but he's like, it's, it's very, it's present. I see. Because wow. they, you got kicked in the head, or because you're stressed out. No, it has nothing to do with kicking the head. No, I think it's because as a child, just trauma as a child, yeah. stuff from childhood that fucked you up. That really it builds proteins in we your eyeballs get around yes. your retina, around your retina. That that makes, that they makes do, your they do hurt? think there's a correlation between your people losing their vision and certain uh, getting bad vision as life goes on from tr- from trauma. Yeah, I've heard Protein. of somebody getting scared blind. Scared blind, scared me blind. Ah. <laughs> Isn't that a fucking wild thing to hear though? Yeah. You have protein on your retina from Does trauma. Does he say it relates to your back? No, this was a whole thing because he was a chiropractor, but he he tries to teach you about chiropractics through neurology, meaning it's actually extremely interesting and nerdy, but th- so much of your brain... Sorry. I'm listening. Oh, sorry, sorry, so sorry, much sorry, of your sorry. brain 
um, dictates your your pain waves of like where yes. you move pain to. Mm-hmm. You can move pain. And some of it's called neuroplastic pain, which I've talked to at Ad Nauseum. There's a great book about it, but neuroplastic Don Sorno, pain is, Have you heard that? Yeah, so, yeah Sorno. Yeah, everybody. Yeah, that, yeah. That's why so many people are like, a lot of pain is like mental in a way. And a lot of pain management takes extensive therapy yeah. and a deep dive into different types of trauma. One of my and, friends had an eyebrow up stuck like this. And she went to a chiropractor. The rock? And, they, and they moved it, it down. down? Yeah. Just one crack in the back. No, a few. Yeah, it took a few. Came in a lot. Yeah. Oh. And she was stuck up like It this. does feel good. No, yeah, pain management is insane, especially because when you're fixing a pain problem, you have to work it out through physical yeah. pain, pain uh, exercises, which make it's it worse. It's so much easier to get oxy. Uh, you're not even kidding. It is, it's so much more fun, too. Yeah, but I shit, and I love to shit. You know, I haven't pooped today. Yeah. And you pooped enough for the both Can't wait. Us. You did? Oh, yeah. I can't wait. I Favorite kind of shit. Favorite kind of shit. Oh, ghost poop, obviously. Oh, no way, you wipe dude. There's nothing? Solids? I want to know it's there. What? I want to know who's been there. No. Hey, who's been there? <laughs> no, I want to see it, but a ghost poop isn't a ghost wipe. No, I don't like that. I want a dear, that I want actually a dear not healthy. John letter when you're done. Should, it's not healthy. Your poop shouldn't, because that means you're a little dehydrated when you have ghost poops. That's a perfect poop because you no, no it's not. Up. No, yeah, you should you can have sh- anal right after. Yeah, well, it should be a little soft. You should have a little bit of softness. Undo. <laughs> you can't have anal right after though. I won't. But you should have a little bit of streaky. Behavior. A little bit of streaky. It shouldn't be like a. Sometimes I get like a wet, like I pissed out my ass, but it's a whole poop, like a membrane. There's my protein again. My favorite shits I mean, are the one where it's, have, you think it's nothing, and then it's so much more. Those are my favorite. You must yeah. have. I Mount hate the reverse. I Rushmore hate the reverse where you think it's eyeballs. so much. Yeah, I know my eyes are brown. You're, That's just all uh, you're, the mountains in her eyes are the fucking Swiss Alps <laughs> of trauma. Mount Chamonix <laughs> on your eye. I see a guy skiing off your eye. <laughs> Sylvester Stallone's the climbing to the top of cliffhanger. <laughs> hey. uh, I love the poops. Sorry, let's get off of that. I love poops. No poop. We'll I get off poop. of it. Get something else. I didn't mean to bring it up. Favorite I've been blood. saying Favorite lately. Favorite period blood type. When I have a. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> that one. Whatever that one is. <laughs> yeah, that's a good oh, one. Oh, yeah. <laughs> kind of like the one that looks like you're blowing a bubble. Favorite farts? Bleep. Shower farts. Pops. <laughs> yeah, it is quick. <laughs> when it questions me. Yeah. What? what? My, my, uh, my best trick around my house. My, my, I like to fart. And then my wife is like, and does that, just the, that thing. And then, and then I'll go, damn it. And I'll just look around at nothing. Yes. And she'll go, get out, get out of here. Yes. Get out of here. The best. <laughs> but I like staring at Leave nothing for a while. Like it, it wasn't me. <laughs> yeah. Mm-hmm. It is me. That's what I, I like do when to I fart queef. the house. And everyone How knows often it's me. Queef? And I go, I don't have sex. Who did that? I'm allergic. When was the last time you had sex? Well, last time I saw you, I was going through epic breakup number 99. That's so right. Since that guy, no sex. No sex since that guy? How many months now? Four. Damn, no, dude. Four. Chosen yeah. celibacy, though? You could get it. Yeah. You just don't want it. I don't know if I could. I demand a certain breed. What kind of breed? Thoroughbred. Mean and Irish. Mean Irish? Stupid bitch. There you go. All right. I'll oh, st- you're a little bit of a whore. Someone right needs to clean up the couch now. <laughs> oh. Yeah. So it you just want, mean you, want, you want mean? You want just like some a guy that treats you like shit? Yeah. Yeah, that's not sucks. nice. I, know, I, told, it's gay. I told her she looked pretty the other night. She's like, you got to stop telling me that. I hate it. The compliments. <laughs> you don't want any compliments? Disgusting. Eh, only Does it make you uncomfortable where your parents fucking, your parents never complimented you? Never. Yeah. No. That's, even now. My mom said when I told her, showed her the half hour I released, she went, it's not your best work, but you're brave for putting it out there. And that was her being very nice. Is your mom that woman from the Goonies? Is yeah. that who that is? <laughs> yeah. It's not your uh, best work. My mom is the principal from Matilda. <laughs> oh, yeah. yeah. I like that lady. Yeah. How cute was that Matilda girl? So cute. Was she cute now? How cute is was that host she, at the cellar? That girl's the cutest girl I've seen. Was she uh, the same girl that was in Miss Doubtfire? Is yeah, that same girl. Talking about? Same girl. Oh, yeah. yeah. Wait, what'd you say? How cute was the host at the cellar? There's a host that works at the cellar now who I think might oh, be the, the girl cutest. the girl at the front door? I think she might be the cutest human being that's ever oh, existed. Why was, was I there? Did I see her last night? She's a tiny girl. You probably have seen her. 
She's tiny, a, tiny person. Tiny little yeah, girl. She just has a cute little. And she's super. You ever fun- see a little she blue funny? pit bull? No, she's a she's a she's a host host. Oh, the door. Ho- oh, right, hostess. Right, right. hostess, hostess, hostess. I thought you meant host yeah. comic. Ian said something sexual about her, and I lost my shit. At what him. you say? What you say? I said she was fucking cute. You That's said, not you said sexual. Something like, I can get it. No, I did not. You said Don't fucking like put that in my you mouth. You said, do you think I, I can get it? You think you can hook up? I did not say that. That's what you said. Oh yeah, I think I heard you say that. Yeah. I think I heard, now that I remember yeah, you going, you think I can smash that bitch? That's what he said. <laughs> that was fucked. Yeah. That was weird. Was I weird. should have said something. Well, I wanted time. to know. <laughs> you thought I could. And I said no. Uh, you learned. I'll figure it out to do it. What did this basement used to be? Bedrooms. It was a sad, sad world where a man named Carl lived. Carl used to live down here? Carl. Yeah, who used Big to get. Carl. What happened used, to him? Who used to get uh, he died medical down here. tested. He died. <laughs> He hit his head. He is no longer. He's he, not here anymore. He's not here no more. What happened to Carl? He hit his head. Carl, Carl, Ian would like to hit his head because Carl owes Ian rent. Yeah. How much? We didn't talk about that on the. Listen here, like Carl. Eight hundred. Eight hundred. We'll get it out of him. <laughs> Enough for him to call, and he left his bicycle here, and he hit Ethan up, and was like, "Hey, I'd like to get my bike back." So I called Carl, and I go, "Hey, fucko." <laughs> you skipped out on rent. You ain't getting the bike back. Yeah, that's how it works. I man. sold it to Joe DeRosa, and he ain't even going to use it. <laughs> he can't ride a bike. It's yeah. hanging up at the sandwich yeah. shop right yeah. now. Yeah, he's he's making self prosada sandwiches off of it. Hey, Gabagool. Hey, how come right? there's no I love That shop, Joey Rose's. It's great. Such good sandwiches. Good people. Good sandwiches. Joey Rose's. Sandwich shop. Dot com. What's the address? I'm sure I was just going to say the address. I forget. It's in the East Village, isn't it? Lower East Side. Oh, it's the Lower East Side? Rivington. Rivy. Go down to Rivington. Come yeah. to Joey Roses. <laughs> yes. We're going to be here for you when you need me to be. You know. <laughs> I love foreign guys that don't know what they're talking about. Where do you need no, me we're going to be open for you to be whenever you have it for us. So have it, we will. <laughs> what time do you guys open? Oh, see, 4 30, maybe. <laughs> 17 o'clock. What time? We are here right now. You come in now. No, I can't come in right no, now. No, we're going to be we here. We are here. I am looking at you. Turn around. I'm Way not here. You. My wife going to be here. You, someone will be here. We're going to close. So maybe close. We, no open every day. <laughs> we open every day. 27 hours a day. No problem. <laughs> no problem. That's Italy, by the way. When you go, That's that's every shop in Italy. Yeah. What time are you guys open? Mm, no, don't know. <laughs> they, 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 clo- they just close. Yeah. They'll just close. I I've think that's so been. fucking rad to be like, go. I'm going to close. To be able to close a business and go fuck off and close it and there's no yeah, like Yeah, but have you ever been the guy that tries to get in the business when it's closed? It's frustrating. Nah, fuck you. Fuck off is the but they're right though. Fuck you. I need yeah, something. Yeah, but we have get a restaurant fucked. right next to his house that closes at 3 p.m. That place can suck my fat cock. 3 no, p.m. They're great. That's not even they're real so time. Great. They're they, so they're good. They're delicious and they're assholes. They're amazing. They're insane. not assholes. Three they're is good insane. people. They're, they're very nice. They're not a breakfast place. Yes, they are. They exclusively serve breakfast. There's so no pancakes. lunch. No pancakes. They oh. do it, pancakes. We had pancakes there the other it's day. It's all greens you and eggs. so <laughs> misinformed on everything. It's really good. Be it's nice. the best. Be yeah, nice. Get, he freaks out. I love them. They're very nice. But they, they don't hook but it they up. But they close at three and that's it. Yeah. But that's okay if they're if they're mostly breakfast meals. They are they're not. 98% breakfast. What I will say that pisses me off about New York now is you used to, everything was 24. Yeah. Nothing's yeah. 20. What's 24? There's only two diners open now. It's what sucks. the fuck is going no on? COVID. But what is that even? I don't even get. They do this. Like that kid would have been serving at a diner, but now he's underground helping with a podcast. Oh, yes. <laughs> and be careful of the proton pack. <laughs> <laughs> when you sit down, <laughs> don't. Um, it is expensive. <laughs> you you can touch it. By the way, I'm doing this now because I watched Love on the Spectrum and last now, night. Oh, now dude. autistic people are working jobs that normal people should be working. Like I went to Delta with my puppy and I was normal like. Normal people? Yeah. Regulars. Yeah, like easy. the show? Good normal people. people. Good oh, goodies, 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 goodies. I like and it. And I yeah. go up to the service desk to Delta, and I'm like, this is my dog. And she's like, well, I see that you have a service animal, but it also says that it's a crated animal. It can't be both at once. You only have one dog, don't you? And I was like, yeah, that's right. And she's like, but it's in two places at once. And that means it's... A-. And I was like, look at me. We're going to be okay. We're going to get through this. And by the end of this exchange, it's going to be written down once, and we'll be... And she was like, okay, thank you. And I was like, I should be back. What are you doing back there? Go yeah, back underground. She needs a job. She needs... To you know, I think in like Germany or Switzerland or something, they, or no, Don't say Germany. Maybe Don't, let's not Argentina, do Germany. Don't do Germany. Spain. Stuff. Someplace it isn't here. Mm-hmm. They elected a, uh, an elected official, a politician has Down syndrome. I just saw that. Spain. We just talked yes, about it on the show. Yeah. Spain. Well, they have Spain. the cop, the Down syndrome cop. Proud of him. Wait, where is that? 
I saw a, a, a video of a kid. Oh, I saw him getting... Oh, he got knighted. No, he was knighted. Oh, he was a, a cop. The queen. No. The this queen knighted him. <laughs> he was being a cop, and then the cop You're was giving him... You're a special little boy. <laughs> <laughs> Do you like the monarchy? <laughs> We, we have to remind him that crayons are not handcuffs. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> He's no, the there's... only cop that doesn't arrest black guys. There's a cop <laughs> in the background who's like a real cop, like a normal cop. Yeah. Who, sorry. Real? Who's, sorry. Yeah, man, really, these words are heavy. Ooh. He's a regular cop and he's standing behind the Same. guy being like, and he looks like he has Down syndrome. And I'm like, oh yeah. This oh, that's is just... no, that was, they wanted to guess, guess who has Down syndrome. Yeah, yeah, that's what it, it was. was yeah. like that. Who wore it better? It guess who? Who wore it better? <laughs> <laughs> wore it better? <laughs> is this dress purple or blue? <laughs> Down syndrome. Okay. Uh, are these stains crackers or Barbie, coffee? And you said the funniest thing I've ever heard in my life. Wait, Down syndrome Barbie? What did I say? What did I say? I told you in the green room at Bad Friends, I was like, yeah, they have a Down syndrome Barbie. Maybe I had a joke about it at the time. And I was like, they're Down syndrome Barbie. And you're like, really? How do you? How can you tell it's Down syndrome? Is she petting a cat too hard? <laughs> she, she comes with a cat. And the cat's like, <laughs> ow! The, the back is arched. It's in, it's in physical pain. <laughs> comes with pants already shat. <laughs> Shat pants. <laughs> Mommy, she shit herself. She always does, sweetie. <laughs> yeah, the Spain Down syndrome. Uh, she's on pa Parliament or something. Parliament, she's on there. Yeah. She's on. That is fucking wild, though. Hey, man. Fuck yeah, dude. We yeah. do. We've been doing it for a long time. We yeah. got. We yeah, done. We got one in there right now. Hey. hey! We done presidents, senators, yeah. yeah, local elected officials. No, those guys are okay. Those guys do nothing wrong. They're good locally people. elected. They're good people. <laughs> <laughs> I think it is really sad that we're entering a time when, like, the Paul Logan and Jake Paul have more political influence than anybody could ever have in politics. And I'm not taking a shot at them. I just mean we've gone so far down our own social rabbit hole. Yeah, we. Who's Logan and Jake Paul? Ron Paul's kids? Ron Paul's kids. Rand Paul's kids. Rand Paul's, Rand Paul. Ron Paul's yeah. son. And Rand, 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 Paul. Rand, Paul. Rand Paul. Rand's nephew. Yeah, I think. Wait, yeah. Ron Paul was sick. And Paul Pierce's neighbor. They all live next to that guy. Which yes. Is nuts. And Paul, Peter Paul, Paul and Mary Peter. actually are delegates. Gotcha. And Paul McCartney's annoying. Mm -hmm. <laughs> He's dead. Statement. I don't know. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> Wait. We gadget. Gadget goo goo. <laughs> Shut the fuck Shut up. The fuck Jake and Jake and he, they're doing things? <laughs> they're internet kids, but they fuck, they're like, billionaires people from, listen to them yeah they're so popular jordan so, peterson popular way bigger really they're with the kids what do you mean jordan what do you mean peterson they're with, oh, with the kids yeah jordan peterson that's not you know that's the problem jordan with someone like you is that <laughs> jordan yeah. Peterson. Yeah. you're just a dumb cunt. when exactly did elliot page's titties become elliot page's when were jordan, they ellen page you need to wipe the shit out of your you pussy <laughs> You need that, to was put, that a Jordan Peterson? Yeah, yeah, yeah. If you have shit in your pussy, Make your bed. nobody's going to be monogamous girls, with you. No, I'll say, girls like Jordan always have poop in their puss. Always. Always. He starts It crying. isn't obvious to me. Make, That's what he always says. Make, it isn't obvious to me. Take your bed and wipe the shit out of your <laughs> pussy. Oh, my God. I'm glad. My mom, mom's watching. Mom, thanks for watching the show. <laughs> pussy poop. Is this a funny bit? Guy who thinks all pussies are big and fat, and he goes like this. <laughs> instead of like this. No, well, what about well, guys? This is it. Too tight. Oh, that's big one. Or this. Yeah. <gasps> or or guy that eats pussy like this. Whoa! Why does he do the wrist thing at Check first? It out. <laughs> Ian, <laughs> come on down. I think I'm gonna start this up. <laughs> this this was a. This was got to be what? I hated 90s? That. Was I this hate the 90s? That. Oh, yeah. This eat me. Up? Eat me raw. Yeah. This grosses yeah. me out. So John Marco does this. What year was this? Suck it, suck it, suck it. 90s. Suck it. They 90s. would get crazy. I just it, saw it, the it, intro it, to my special, and I jump up and do a suck it, and we're keeping it Fuck in. you. Really? Yeah, yeah, That's yeah, funny. Yeah, yeah, yeah. What about this? When did this come? When, when did this start? Louis C.K. <laughs> no. Has he started it? Yeah. No. What year was this? year was this for real? This when somebody went, what was that? That's Italy. 1907. Hey, hey yeah. fuck Eddie. Hey, fuck Eddie. I'm putting the evil eye on. That's Well, no, people, people used to do this, and then it evolved to that. The I spray. didn't even think about the Louis Jackie off. I just in his comedy, he always would be like, for him. Yeah, that is true. He would do that. Yeah, but this, this, it used to just go ah, like that. 
It used to be just. I liked it. It was cooler when it was just. Ah, eh, fuck you. That was a fuck you. That's. Really, I like. This I like, is lame. I didn't like the. Th- the not that. Not thing. just. It's rude. like fuck you, it but is. like. Who gives a shit like that? Yeah, like, that's a cool one. Yes, like that's very daisy that's confused. My mom oh, did. this. See, that's interesting. Is your mom an immigrant? Italian. Or her dad was. Because what about immigra- this? Because immigrants hold it. Yeah. But Americans like threw it away. Fuck this you. was. Uh, this is what, what Italian. This is it Italiano? Oh yeah. Oh yeah. Yeah. What is that? Just two penises? Yeah. Oh, he's gonna do it with his dick right what now. What about this? No, 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 no. What? No, no, no. You're not allowed to. No, do no. This. It's it's what Italians do. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, that is what Italians do. I come and sit on my lap, eh? <laughs> a peep a popo. I come and say DJ. Look at that fucking belt. That's that is a big boy belt. <laughs> That's a big boy belt. I like my own ass. <laughs> that really is. That's a nice one. And are you native? Yes. That's a native belt. Yes. And you lie. You always like. Oh, you wear a lot of opal. No, I'm not native, Turquoise. but I love Turquoise. Native sorry, American sorry, sorry. spirituality no. culture. I'd like to read. Listen to this. <laughs> o ye people, be ye healed. Life ye. anew, I bring ye. unto ye. O ye people, be ye healed. Life anew, I bring unto ye. Is this a Through Metallica the father song? Over, shut up, I'm praying. Through the one under me. O ye people, under me. This, I heard him do this. Life anew, I bring unto ye. O ye people, <laughs> be ye healed. Yeah. Life anew, I bring unto ye. Through the father Ian. over all I do thus. Life this anew. Sucks. I bring this is hurting. Ye. Wait, let me see. Let me see. Is this really a? Is this a Bible? Yeah, really that was Bible? from Good Eagle. Oh uh, yeah, that was a good album. You can't be good. That can't be your Indian name. Is Good Eagle? Well, it's better than his nephew. Fair enough, Bird. <laughs> <laughs> mediocre, gu- <laughs> mediocre. <laughs> Pretty <elk>. good. <laughs> Fair enough, Bird. I like that. <laughs> uh, these are a bit longer. But, uh, put it away. You don't need to read yeah, that. Yeah. It's my prayer book. Yeah, feel free. He goes, put it away. You go, yeah, feel free. <laughs> <laughs> there you go. Do you want to become blood brothers? Yeah, man. You start. How'd you get that oh! cut on your hand? Huh? How'd you get that cut on your hand? Opening an Amazon box? Uh, That's my guess. Jeff Bezos. He did it. I it. slid it on a... Uh, don't say slid. I slit. I slid. Oh. Yeah, I slid my thumb into that's some girl's. Slit. That's a slot. Different. That's a <laughs> tavern that's a parking slot. garage. That's a sealed over conch. <laughs> How much to park there? No, you got to knock. Yeah, to what yeah. is that? Seven bucks an hour. You got to chisel it all. Hey, do you? Uh, you need a pickaxe. Ian, you've had, you've had, you've had, you, you've had, you've, you've had sex, sex, sex workers though. Yeah, you have. Yeah, yeah every day. How often do you think you've gotten? Met sex? one last night or two nights ago. Hold on, wait. What's that called? Do you <laughs> not do you valet park? Do you? When they stamp the parking, validate. Validate. Yep. Do you validate? Got to validate that parking spot. Is that worth it for you? I think my something's happened in my brain. <laughs> <laughs> <There's> sometimes <laughs> I, I, it's like things yes. don't come out of my mouth, yeah. right? It's a lack of oxygen. You think it's? You can say it. You think Aging? it's the booster? <laughs> oh, <laughs> it's yes. the booster. That's. Do you know why so many of our friends are getting cancer? Um, no, no. Who's getting cancer? Everybody you know. Tuvan throat singing Metallica. Um, no, no, that's no, that's God's That's God's Metallica's so more of a hey, yeah, yeah, yeah. You have to stop screaming. Ethan says. Hey, yeah, yeah. They don't sound like that. Oh, yeah, I see. Yeah. Yeah, he does Touch that. Touch within, that. walk within, keep you free uh, from sin. Touch, Touch, Touch with him, walk with him. Yeah. Touch within. Touch with him, walk with him, keep away from sin. I am a crossing guard. <laughs> <laughs> Light is green, must you go? No one here, don't touch him. <laughs> Touch with him, <laughs> Walk with him, touch his hand. <laughs> Buddy sister him. <laughs> Wait till you see the red red lights <laughs> cross the street. <laughs> Wave my hand. <laughs> We're up to never never land. <laughs> <laughs> Oops, you dropped your bag lunch. Oops, you dropped your bag again. <laughs> 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 I can't walk. Touch with him. Walk with him. Keep you free from it. Just, just teaching somebody how to exist. Touch with him. Walk with him. A dad giving a sex talk. <laughs> Touch, Touch her here, him. not over. Here. Did you guys get sex talks? Yeah. yeah. You did? No, no, no. My I mom never gave me one. a book called "What's Happening to My Body." It was like, just read this. What's happening? 
What? My, she made me watch said What's Happening. That sex is the most important. <laughs> I thought thing. sex was just a black guy in a red <laughs> a hat. Black named Rerun. <laughs> <laughs> I never got the talk. We never even remotely came close to it. I mean, I went to my mom. I was like, I think I had sex, and she was like, Did you fuck up your sheets? It was like that. <laughs> that oh my god! Yeah, it's so brutal. supportive. Yeah, we were having sex very young. How old were you when you lost your virginity? Fifteen. Mm, that's not that young. What do you mean? That's normal. Yeah, how old we was were, the fella? It took a while to get I was, the sex, You know what I mean? Yeah, how old was the guy? I got my period 42. after 42. Yeah. <laughs> how old was the guy when you were 15? He was 15? 15? Yeah. I was 16. What were you? 19. I had a girl at a sleepover <laughs> who wanted to do stuff. <laughs> what are you laughing at? Touch with him. I said with to him. her, I go, touch, touch with, with him. him. <laughs> touch with him. Suck my him. Touch with him. Suck with him. Don't look at me. I just really Don't like look at me. the idea of Metallica being practical people just teaching you how to walk around. Cross, well, how to walk. <laughs> hey, look, Cab, it's okay. It'll be safe for you. <laughs> <laughs> Don't tip too much. 20% is too much. <laughs> 20% is too much for the Jack Cab. Can we talk about that? No, no, Jack hey. Jensen. Jack you okay? Jensen. I'm all right. Are you Jack, uh, Jack Johnson? You're a big Jack, Jack Johnson? Jack Jensen is my dad who died of cigarettes, and he sounded oh. like that before yeah. he died. Wow, I thought he was that beach singer. That was also my dad. That was your dad? Yeah. Yeah. What was the song he sang? Jack Ski Johnson. When we're together. What was the song? I think it was supposed to be that. Yeah, it was Baba Da Ba Deem Dom. Wait, what were you talking about before I interrupted you? I'm sorry. Oh, your sex talk, you were gay and stuff. What? <laughs> what happened? You had sex with a girl in 19? Was it a girl or a boy? What was your first boy? When? Kevin. First, touchy touch or sucky suck? All the above. Sucky suck 11. Yeah. Same. Touchy touch, first or second grade. Yeah, same. I was touching dick in first grade. Andrew's I was in sucking dick place. in. You was first uh, uh, eleven. You got the parts. That's yeah, very 12, young. Twelve, eighth grade. First time you put your finger in your butt. One year old. Never. Didn't get out of town and come on back. <laughs> <laughs> you really never put your finger in your butt ever. Get out of here and <laughs> stay I a while and then put make my your finger in my butt. Here. I'll wake up with my finger in my butt. I do it now, yeah. yeah I'm doing right. it right now. <laughs> <laughs> Being in. <laughs> you never you never did it. You never a just girl how did you even her find out? Upper butt and made me smell it when we were in first that grade. That girl's cool. That girl's rad. What like she that what she, she was my first to? kiss in in first grade she, she came and she went like this. Yeah. She <laughs> sat next to me and kissed me, and I go, oh, wow, I really like that. You can do that whenever you want. And she did it again, and I fell out of my chair, and my mom laughed so hard she had to leave the house. <laughs> you really? Do you remember this? Uh-huh. God, my memory's yeah, so bad. It was like bad. a Fisher-Price. I, I remember it was a Fisher-Price fake, like, picnic table with uh, four chairs we were sitting on, and then uh, she shoved her finger up her bum one day at recess and made me smell it. <laughs> And then, I would play 9-11 on recess where we would, after 9-11, we'd dig burrows under the playground and hide from terrorists. How old were you when 9-11 happened? Fifth grade. Wow. I know. Crazy. Se se 17. You guys played 9-11 fun yard games. What'd you play? We played 9-11. Maybe we have to go to war. You gotta go to Maybe war. I, have to yeah. go. I was old enough to go to war. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> That's crazy. My play 9-11 was dodging the draft. Did you? There was yeah. no draft. No. <laughs> but there should have been. We should have oh, yeah. gone over there, dude. I remember talking to this kid at the mall and he had a shaved head. He's like, I'm going over there after what they did to what us. They did. And I was like, as if he was us? just going to get in his mom's minivan. Where I'm going. Get in. It's way further than you think, Dude, man. Did you go dudes. to prom? I did go to prom. I did go to prom. What year did you graduate high school? Oh, two. Oh, two. Oh, two. Oh, two. Oh, three. No shit, dude. Yeah, dude. Oh, two. Yeah, graduated. Oh, two. Oh, you're three. You're 39. 39, dude. When you 40. turned 40. December 31st. Is it oh, scary? Fuck. Is it I scary? I think this year it's on a Saturday. Yeah, it's on Saturday. Crazy that you know that. Yeah, we'll go to fucking Tony's. Yeah. Tony's Joey house. Rose's. Yeah, Joey. Joey. Go to Joey oh, Rose's. dude, we go to Joey Rose's. I had sex in that bathroom one time. No <gasps> shit, dude. I had sex yeah. in almost every stall at the gutter. Lie. True. L true. Same guy. Same guy. Big old hug. Worked there. He's a pin monkey. No, Works at the bowling alley. That. It's a pin setter. No, that's a dog. Right, a pin setter. That's what they got back. Imagine a dog just setting up pins. How funny would that be? 
That'd be awesome. Let's go. Move it. Move it. <laughs> a dog's trying to just take a nap. <laughs> will you play that? Will you play that instrument for me? Yes. <clears throat> What are you doing here for your movie? Pro press press. What does that look like? What is that like? Um, did you not want me to play? Shut I mean, up. what's happening? What's well, it like? You only need a second of that. Yeah. You don't need more than that. <laughs> press for a movie is like. You yeah. Go, what are you doing in this town of ours? I want to see both of you guys. Tell us. You just go and you go to a room with fucking corporate press people, and they're like, "We have to do commercial shoots for like when it airs on TV." So you have to wear a certain outfit? Yeah. They give it to you? No. No. Men don't get stylists. Women, usually women either require them in their contracts or they have their own. Or they, when I did late night, they were like, I, we can't do anything. There's nothing they could fix. They yeah. can't fix that. Yeah. I had a car hard on. They were like, They're like, uh, you're totaled. We they can't like, fix this. <laughs> 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 Take it to the junkyard. <laughs> Trek. I mean, we could sell it for scraps, but they it's not like, going to be This is much. the bit, right? This is the bit. And I was like, I want to hair and makeup. And they're like, no, uh, good one. They good don't, one. they don't, no, you'd have to pay for, that is what's funny about the business is it's so fucking janky. But like women, like, I'm sure, like, je fucking, what's her name? Uh, like, Jennifer Lawrence. I'm sure she has, like, a whole team and a package that's included in her. But, like, when we go do press and stuff, no, there's nobody, like, no. You have a handler that, like, picks you up and tells you what room Chelsea. to go to. And then you go in there. <laughs> She's there, yeah. I fuck black guys. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Shut the fuck but up. But I also go to Africa and help black people, not to be confused with the black guys. I'm fucking a lot of blacks. <laughs> black, black. <laughs> She's fucking... No, yeah, they don't really do. They don't do shit. They you just show up and and it's... you do a shoot like a trailer, like a yeah. We'll do a bunch of trailers and all that shit. It's uh, honestly it's just like the same questions over and over, right? A lot of times it's stuff that they they email you what they want you to do, and then you just say no. I want to just do it like this, and then uh... and then they do have questions. Yeah, like the oh, there's always something that's like. Who's the wackiest on set? And it's oh. like, nobody. We're tired. Everyone's just doing everyone's it. Tired. Yeah, everyone's tired. Yeah, everyone's tired. You yeah. were up at four and you're shooting till eight or 9 p.m. Nobody's like, pulling, who's pulling pranks? It's like, nobody. Bill you're Murray exhausted. was a big prankster on set. Yeah, because he probably showed up for like two hours and yeah. left. And he was late, I'm sure, every day. And he was lit. Oh, yeah, he was fucked up. He was he's the best. Fun. Yeah, he's the man. I just rewatched What About Bob like three times in a row. What about Bob? The best fucking movie. Have you ever seen it? Fuck it's my you. favorite. Honestly, do you have a salt substitute? Comedy of all. Have I seen it? I can pull out the. I can pull Bob, out the real the, real lines. The. Uh, oh, Mrs. Is that me and my mom at my house. My mom still goes. We still go when we eat. We go. Mm, Mrs. Mm. M. Mm. Mm, 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 mm. Mm. My mom does it all the time. My I dad's like, like cut it out. You stop it. <laughs> yeah, that's my dad. My oh. dad is Richard Dreyfus. Literally. What's he? What's he do when I when he calls him and he goes, "Your sister's on the line," and he goes, "The uh, the patient doctor." Agreement is that you do not violate trust. When you call and pretend you were my sister, you are violating, violating trust. my trust. That's exactly right. <laughs> Calling and pretending. Lake Winnipesaukee. Going up to Lake Winnipesaukee. Lake Winnipesaukee. <gasps> I know. Oh, it's such a good movie. Oh, <laughs> I'm a dear. sailor. I sail. Ahoy. Oh, it's such a good film. Oh, it's really? the best. It's, 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 it's more great. quotable to me than all the other qu overquoted films. Yeah. Like the overquoted Borats or all that shit. Like yeah. mm -hmm. to me, what about Bob has uh, so many lines? Roses Baby are red, steps. violets, violets are, are blue. blue. I'm, I'm a, a schizophrenic, schizophrenic and, and so, so am I. That's really good. He's incredible. And that's it's, all improv. That scene of, of him in the, that was all improv. Him in the in the psych ward or whatever. Really? Yeah, learning, earning their respect. They said, I, from what I heard, they did a bunch of different takes of it. Oh and that's the one God. they chose. I just rewatched Groundhog Day and it was so comforting just being, just his energy. He's incredible yeah. in that. He's and so he does good. exactly what all of us would do. Yeah. yeah. You'd rob a bank, eat as much, smoke yep. as much, drink as much, do whatever you want, kill yourself every single day. Mm -hmm. Yeah. <laughs> you, we would do the same thing. They, you know they've taught that movie in colleges and philosophy classes because people really? try to figure out how many days and years each iteration of it is like how many how many years did it take for him to master flicking cards how many days did it take for oh, him to do certain things and then it brings up all these philosophical questions of was it 10,000 days or you know 10,000 years that he was stuck in this loop like how long did it take him I bet to it was a week <laughs> it was just one week three days yeah like you learned piano he's a concert yeah, pianist yeah. yeah look I gotta fuck this girl what, what was her what beautiful. was her drink what was her drink was who, who drank? He remembered her drink. What was her drink? <gasps> Sweet vermouth drink. on the rocks. That's right. With a twist. Are you yes. crazy? And what did she toast to? You guys are dorks. World, World peace. peace. How do you not know this? I don't know it. 
Jesus fucking Christ. I just watched it again for the first time in years. Watch out for that step. It's, it's a, a doozy? doozy. Yeah, all right. You got Bing. it. You got one. Bing. I could do all of Liar Liar. Ned? You, do, uh, you can do Liar Liar? 100% of it. All of it. Go ahead. I'm trying to think of a niche thing now that I know if you know it that well. Uh, what I'm going to do is I'm going to piss and moan like an impotent jerk and then bend over and take it up the tailpipe. <laughs> tailpipe is such a great, that's such a great word. Yeah. <laughs> what about what, uh, Hi, Mr. Reed. Do you like my hair? <laughs> and he goes, whatever takes whatever the focus, takes the focus, focus on your face. face. <laughs> so good. Yeah. He was so good. Or <gasps> he's a pedantic, pontificating bastard, a belligerent fart, a worthless, steaming pile of cow dung. Figured it be speaking. God, that's wow, so good. that was good. I didn't know that one. I you don't know any of those. You make up for all your lack of everything else. Yeah. I know what? all of my, I used to watch it obsessively. I wrote him letters, Jim Carrey letters. Did he write you back? Never. Because he's on a, and now he's on a real philosophical kick, man. Because I would yeah. write Jim Carrey and put it these in videos? the box. Oh, with his long hair and. Yeah, I just watched one last night when I was brushing my teeth. That's very funny that we're talking about this, but I watched it last night and I got a little bummed out by it. I nothing remember- matters. There nothing matters. He's on these like rants and you're like, didn't you? Does it kill your no? Ex? But it's just like nothing didn't matters. He, what do you mean nothing matters? Die in his. But he orbit? does some cool film, like when he was on the red carpet and he was like, "I decided to go to the place where not, where everything was narcissistic and and people were insane." And she was like, "Well, thanks for being here, yeah. Jim." Yeah, him trolling them is funny, but he's still a part of it. That's what the yeah. irony is. Like, if you really wanted to be cool, you would just get out of it completely. Yeah. That's my problem. He's very annoying. It's like, it's like when someone's like, thing. "Fuck the machine." It's like you're still playing with it. Yeah, stop playing with yeah. it. Yeah. If you don't like Morello. it so much, move to the woods. What yes. about when Matt? Stone and Trey Parker took acid and, and went, went to, to the, the yeah. award so show. So that's in them dressing. actually fucking with the machine, and then yeah. they don't fuck with it. They go yeah. do. They show up. They shit on them, and Who then they that? never show up again. Matt, Matt, South Park Stone writer and Trey Parker from South Park. That's awesome. They They're showed up kids. on acid, and they dro- he dressed up like Jennifer. Uh, yeah. What t- what can I think of her Lopez. name? Jennifer Lopez. Jennifer Lopez. And anytime yeah. they got asked a question, they'd be like, "This is a beautiful night. It's nice to be around so many stars." Like they said, so the many same. stars. And yeah. They'd be like, "What's up with the dresses?" They'd be like, "Beautiful night. It's good to be here. Just amazing being around so many stars." <laughs> <laughs> that's awesome. If you're gonna do it, that's the fun oh, way to yeah. do it. Yeah. Yeah. No, I just didn't. Li- I don't like it when, if you say "fuck the machine," that's rad. But then you can't be near the machine anymore. Can I just say one thing real quick? Sure. Always can. Always do. Go ahead. Meanie, weenie, meanie, weenie. You guys are so mean to each other, but it's wonderful. Uh, go ahead, say your thing. Let's yes. see what it is. But you it. both do it. I do it out of love. So does she. Go ahead. <laughs> I don't want to. <laughs> no, come on. What is it? I really want to know. I need to know, please. Really? I won't be. Okay. Yeah. What? <laughs> come on. Come on, kiddo. Oh, please. <laughs> Tell us, Daddy. How cool is it that Warren Zevon, Mm. when he was dying, wrote an album about his own death? Yeah. And he has a song called Keep Me in Your Heart, which is Keep Me in Your Heart Heart for for a while. while. Black Star, David Bowie did that too. Uh not not the same. No. Not the same thing. No. What do you mean? He had cancer of sign to me by Black Bar. He made Black Bar mean me. Yeah, but but this, when but, you get up in the morning and you see that crazy sun, keep me in your, your heart, heart for a while. That's so sad. By the way, yeah, it is a tear. Da, 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 Dude, it's 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 so beautiful. And by the way, his last words or his last um advice on Letterman, Letterman. was the best. Enjoy, Enjoy every, every sandwich. sandwich. <gasps> oh. Oh, that's the yes, thing that you made me thing. take a picture in front yes, of you. That I was trying to tell you about, and you didn't listen until someone else was here on a podcast. Also, such a good line. You didn't tell me. Sandwiches really are so fucking good. They're, They're the, the best. best. I had a sandwich last night at they one in the morning. They are such in my hotel. a good common denominator, like common ground thing to talk. Everybody to about. likes sandwiches. Yeah. They're the best food. They're all foods together. Nobody in one food. doesn't want sandwiches. You know sandwiches. what my favorite sandwiches? Go peanut butter pickle. <laughs> What are you pregnant? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> what are you always pregnant? What are you a fat bitch? Are oh, you a fatty patty? I love it. We had it as kids. It, my mom always made it. And was like, this is what this is what you eat. And oh, what we you have. were. And now I you were it. poor. Groomed. Yeah. 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 yeah but dude, peanut butter pickles. Poor is people do we know that are like, I had mayo sandwiches. Well, usually it was I usually bologna. Bologna is the number one. No, but we weren't we weren't trash poor. We were hippie poor. Oh, we, were we like, lo- I love bologna sandwiches. Loose loose bologna sandwiches are the best. You ever have cooked spam? But I'll tell you this, dude. You ever have bologna? Cheese, Pickle mayo, and peanut mustard. butter. What Come on. On white bread? On white bread. Let's cut, go to town. Cut so it's cinched? So it's cinched? I would. Peanut butter and I, pickle? Yeah, it's no, good. No, no, it is good. I've had it. No. Really? No, it is good. Yeah, I've had peanut butter pickle. Yeah. But it's but it's Clawson's? like- Clawson's? It's, it's Clawson's. Still. Pickle. 
What is Smooth going peanut. <laughs> Closets? <laughs> is this show sponsored by Closet? You brought it up 10 times. <laughs> Did he? Never, not once. Hey, uh, I'm coming out of the, the inf- closet. <laughs> <laughs> oh, my God. <laughs> this show's been pretty crisp, though. It has been fun front to back. It's been crisp. Got, like got a, a good snap on it. Clausen's pickle. Got a good do you have guests on, on your podcast? <laughs> what? Is it, but do, primarily, do you have it just you and Bobby with Jetski? You switch. Uh, no, we, we, sometimes she's not, she's often not there because she's on the road. So I now we have so much fun with it. her in Austin. She's the fucking best. We had dude. Such She's a, a good sweetie. Time. We scared her on it this podcast. The best, the nah, nah, you didn't. Oh, she we told had me a good time. she had a blast. Okay, yeah. good. She had a dude, blast. We, it, it was we were watching like uh, Tony and David Lucas like roasting the audience in like such a fucking like demoralizing way. <laughs> and when they'd come on the stage, me and her were both like, "You're a really good person. <laughs> like your leg isn't that fucked up." <laughs> like we were like nice, <laughs> <That's awesome>. complimenting <laughs> them to like make sure they. There needs to be a themselves. therapist in the back that's like, "They're just, everyone's just kidding." Oh yeah, yeah. That's what we were saying. We were like, "These are just jokes. Your your skin condition isn't that bad." But it is You're true. Really Every cool. kid around the country who has like a just like a insane disability is like I've got to go on Kill Tony it's like it's like it's simple. Dude, it's almost like what the, it's like the, it's like Howard Stern would just be like how many weirdos can we get yeah. <laughs> Kill Tony's like what hold my beer the greatest <laughs> thing I ever saw was New Year's Eve me and Duncan are walking down the street and a guy is holding a dog and his shirt says kill yourself and he goes oh my god guys I just did my first set of kill and he runs into the pole and the dog goes arr, arr, and he drops the dog and he goes ow my head oh my and I would just go on <laughs> It was such a perfect example. Of Kill Tony. Yeah. yeah. Of the Kill Tony Cruise. That's a shirt that says it Kill is a, Yourself. It is a good collection of fucking the weirdest people on earth. And they found a, what a, they're playing, aren't they playing the garden? Dude, it's amazing. What? It's, That's what I, heard. I love doing that shit. What do you it's mean so they fun. are playing? As in they are having a panel of people. A live people They're doing a live podcast from the garden. From Madison wow. Square Garden. Yeah. And I'm, I'm playing it too. I'm playing, but I'm playing guitar. <laughs> Which is fuck because I don't play guitar, but I booked it. So it'll be crazy. It would be You'll so, figure it, out. it would be so dope to book like a huge theater tour, but not do stand up. Yeah, like, just get up there and do something. Well, that's else. what Louis did when he did MSG off recently, where he just had a jazz band open for like a long time. Really? Like, and he, long and he, time. Did he only did like twenty minutes. It was somebody from Coltrane actually, or something like that. And John was, Coltrane? Coltrane? No, there's no band called Coltrane. <laughs> you mean Coldplay? No, Coldplay. it was. Train. No. Train. Drops to Jupiter. <laughs> no. Cold world. Cold it war kids. Cold war kids. Cold war kids. Who's, what's John, John Coltrane? What's he like? John Coltrane's dead. He's okay, dead. He's it been, wasn't him. It was long, long, long. Long. They could have had him up there. <laughs> <laughs> we got a Bernie. <laughs> Joe Biden. <laughs> they had somebody play for a really long time. And then Who's John a Fish went Hologram. <laughs> Dizzy collapse. Wow, wow, we do that. Wow, we do that. Louis had Fats Muppet. Domino <laughs> open for, for a really long time. Little Richard was there. Jordan, I think you've been in a coma. <laughs> It was somebody big, but I can't remember who. <laughs> but they but they opened too long. It was a long time. Yeah, I think it'd be nice to book a tour, but not do stand-up. I think it'd be fun to throw Bro, a I want to sing in a hardcore band so bad. You could. Yo, there's a band, Manchester, United Kingdom, going off. Shout out. They have a new album coming out. They had me sing on one of their tracks. Their band is called Manchester, United no, Kingdom? Their, their band is called Going Off. They're a really good hardcore band. They have a new album coming out, and I sang on one of the tracks. What, what did you sing? It sounds... A little something like this. Play. Well, Just, I, kidding. Oh, Ian. Sorry. I you don't need that. that. You don't want that. <laughs> Why do you have that? Just get a gun. <laughs> get a gun. Just get a gun. Lenny Marcus. How about a gun? How about, How about a gun? How about a gun? I'll shoot you. I'll shoot you. How about I shoot that? you in the Can I see that? Head? What do you Let think see of this that? toy? You know? Yeah, look at this. Hand it to me with the, the zapper. Taze yourself. Out. It feels good. You can taste yourself. Yeah, it's like a shot of espresso. Wow, God. No. No, I don't want to. No, I, Andrew. When you see it, you go, no. When you feel it. it, yeah. Go ahead, taste if yourself. I do it, you'll do it. Oh. I just said taste yourself. <laughs> you know, when you do it, you'll do it. Ah. You didn't do it. I just watched you. Do no, it. No. no, nice try. Do your neck. I hate this game. Don't do your neck. It'll Don't do it, dude. Your brain. You if can I do, do your it, leg. will you do it? No. Fine. <laughs> I mean, no. It's great. You still said we'd be blood brothers. <laughs> Let's cut each other's dicks off. Let's cut Wu-Tang this episode Clan. off. Okay, yeah. Let's end. Bye. <laughs> <laughs> It was so good. <laughs> Cut off. Oh yeah, hey.
<laughs> I don't know when this comes out. <laughs> Two weeks. Two weeks. Uh, I'm on tour. Me and Bobby Lear on tour. Me and my favorite little dumpling are on tour. Go to badfriendspod.com. Badfriendspod.com. We got, I don't know, like six cities left or something like that. Seven cities left. And then we're not touring for a long. We won't tour again until 2025. Whoa. Together. We're just going to do our separate things. We want to work on ours. That's the best. And I'm also, I'm in a movie that'll be out on Amazon called Ricky Stinicky. Go watch that. That'll be funny, I hope. It will be. 